DIY Pothole Patching, The Homeowner's Guide. Hey, I'm Judd Burden, President of Asphalt Kingdom, been in the industry for more than two decades, and I wanna to speak to you about what it's like to do your own pothole patching repairs on your driveway and or parking lot. You see, over time, the asphalt gets fragile. The sun beats down on it, and the asphalt ends up being fragile and solid, and as the ground moves, it cracks. Water gets down into the foundation and ultimately erodes it, leaving the asphalt to not bear its own weight and it collapses, turns into a depression, a pothole, sinkhole, and then becomes a liability risk. Last thing you want is somebody tripping on your property and getting hurt. So what we do here is provide you with the homeowner's guide so that you can do your own DIY asphalt patching so that you don't have any tripping hazards and that you can protect your pavement asset for years to come, saving you money so that you don't have to replace it as often. Here are the three easy steps that you need to take to do proper asphalt patching. First and foremost, make sure that you have the right safety gear. Have your gloves and have your eyewear and make sure that that's on you ready to get to work. Next, you'll make sure that you go to that pothole patch and you remove any of the loose dirt and debris in that patch area. Go down about two inches and make sure that void is there with no loose debris left in that area. Then what you'll do is you'll go ahead and seal around the whole patch with a rubberized crack sealer. That prevents water from getting in around the patch, eroding the foundation, and then having to do the same pothole patching again. Next, I wanna show you a demonstration that shows you the step-by-steps that you need to do in order to do proper DIY pothole patching. Check this video out. You're going to heat up that asphalt area with the two foot by two foot mini infrared unit. It takes about seven minutes to be able to do a two and a half inch heat press. That infrared unit, once it does the heat press, you're going to take a rake and you're going to rake the ex extremities of the asphalt pothole with the chunks of asphalt you've put in, blend it all together. Then you're going to take a vibrating plate or a plate compactor and you're going to compact that asphalt patch area so that it's completely smooth and finished like new. You see, super easy to do your own DIY pothole patching. Just a few easy steps. You save money, you have a safe parking lot and or driveway, and you also make it look great. I'm really interested in knowing a little bit about the biggest problems that you have on your driveway. Do you have potholes? Do you have bird bass? Do you have cracks on your driveway? Go ahead and comment below. I want to hear it. I also, if you're in a particular state or province in Canada, we'd love to hear which province and or state you think has the most potholes that need patching in North America. Comment down below and go ahead and click that subscribe button and that ringy bell notification to get notified every time that we push out content. Thank you and welcome to your asphalt kingdom. If you like this video, go ahead and check out this video or check out this video. And don't forget, like, comment and subscribe right here below.